vlog. Today's video is very exciting because I'm prepping for a girl's trip and this video is in partnership with Bath and Body Works, which is very exciting, but I'll get to that later. You guys saw this morning, I lit a candle. It's the scent, cotton candy champagne, and it's delightful, it's very Christmassy. So yeah, very excited to chat with you about all the things going on this week. As I mentioned, going on a trip this weekend, we're going up to Mount Washington, myself and 10 friends, and I'm so looking forward to it. I'm very excited and I've been working on getting gifts and everything together, which is basically going to be the premise of this vlog. I'm surprising everyone with like cute little gifts and DIYs and something very exciting I'm actually gonna go pick up right now. I reached out to the brand Carisdale Cocktails, which is a local gin cocktail brand and I have been wanting to try their stuff for probably about a year now. So I reached out to them and they're kindly gifting us some bottles to try. So gotta go pick that up. I love when things are local and I can just drive and get them. So that's what we're gonna do this morning. And I actually got myself ready today. Makeup and hair, it's cause I knew I was filming this video and then also some TikToks and some other content and stuff. So we're feeling good. Cute new sweater from Revolve. I love the color so much. It's such good quality and it's very cozy. I think I'm gonna wear it with my vest here, but yeah, anyway gotta go because I told her I'd come pick them up within the hour and we're cutting it close. Okay, just picked up all of the Carisdale cocktail mixes. There's five of them. I think she gave us a couple different flavors. I'm so excited. Look at how cute this bottle is. The packaging is like perfect. And then we have this one, the Mountain View, which is actually really funny because I used to live on Mountain View Avenue in Victoria. So cute. Next stop is the liquor store to buy more alcohol. <laughs> okay, out of the liquor store now. I'm gonna sanitize my hands, this one. It's also from Bath & Body Works. This is the Spread Love Not Germs Sea Salt and Citrus. It smells so good. Their hand sanitizers are just the absolute best. I'm obsessed, they smell so good. Highly recommend. Great stocking stuffer too. Okay, so I went to the liquor store because obviously the Carisdale cocktails are to share. So I wanted to pick up some alcohol for myself. I got a bottle of red wine. This is from Basque. I haven't actually tried this wine yet. I've been curious about it because I've tried the other Basque wines and their like shtick is that they're zero percent sugar. Not sure what that means in a red wine. It's a Pinot Noir. Don't know if that, I don't buy red very often. I normally go for like the vintage ink red. That's probably my favorite, but we're going to try something new. It seems like quite light. So anyway, going to get that. I got that. I'm going to drink that. And then of course, big gin fan and I love Tanqueray. So I just repurchased the Tanqueray Rang Pure. Rang Pure? It's a very beautiful bottle and it has like limes and botanicals and more flavor than the regular one and uh, I currently have half a bottle of this in my freezer but I want to make sure I have a fresh one for this weekend so that's what I picked up. It kind of just worked out me doing these errands today because I was going to do them tomorrow but now that I'm out and about picked up all the alcohol that's checked off. I did my Costco grocery shop already that was on Monday. I already gave the stuff to Nicole so she can pack it in her car because um, I said I have a big box of things I'm bringing which is true and I won't have room for everyone's stuff and I think the last thing I want to do today to get off my list is go to the gluten-free bakery because I'm going to pick up some pizza crust for us to use. Maybe I'll see what other fun treats they have but that's next. I made it to the gluten-free bakery, so I'm gonna go in and hope they have some pizza crust. All right, picked up the dough. Just grabbed a regular pizza dough. It's also vegan. They did have a sourdough one, which I was kind of curious about, but I just got regular because I wasn't quite sure. And then, I, of course, I had to pick up a couple little treats. So I got a cinnamon bun, and then under is a salted espresso cookie for Cody when he wakes up. Cute little afternoon snack. Thinking about getting a coffee, but I decided I'll just have one at home and then enjoy my little treat. I have everything laid out on my floor here and I'm gonna pack everything up and label the bags and everything. And I'll just walk you guys through all of the stuff I'm gifting. I'm so excited. This is like my favorite part is like putting it all together and putting the tag on. I was totally gonna wait and do this like tomorrow, but I can't cause I'm just like too excited. So here we go. First thing they're getting is a custom mug. So I got these mugs at Ikea and then using my Cricut, I was able to customize everyone's name on them. I thought this was really smart to do, especially because we're going to a cabin and everyone's gonna be drinking many things out of these mugs so kind of fun that we have them customized i love the font and i just did them all in white so you can even take cute pictures and i specifically put it where it is so like when you're taking a picture out the window 
you can have your name. And then Bath and Body Works was so kind and sent over a bunch of products for me to gift and they're all holiday themed, which is amazing. The scent of everything is cotton candy champagne and I'm obsessed with this packaging. It's so Christmassy. So they sent over the shower gel, which I love the Bath and Body Works shower gels. And I've already started using this in my shower. It smells so nice and it lathers really, really well. They sent over the fine fragrance mist, which of course you can use on your body, but I also like using these as like room sprays. And then another product I have already started using as well is the 24 hour moisture ultimate hydration body cream in the same scent. And it smells so good and it's very, very moisturizing, which I need in the winter. So love that. And then they also sent over the candles, same scent, so cute. I love a candle. I think everyone loves candles, so love that. And then this is in a different scent, but this is actually my favorite Bath and Body Works scent, which is winter candy apple. And so everyone gets a little mini hand sanitizer and I'm obsessed. I think it's so cute. So I have all of those products. I have most of those things in the bag and then I have some fuzzy socks to include as well and of course the gift tags. So I think I'm gonna put the gift tags on the bag. I need to find some string and just like have it hanging off and hopefully pack everything. I don't think the mugs are gonna fit in and I also wanna make sure that they travel pretty nicely. And so I do have some bubble wrap here and I have this giant box that I'm going to be packing everything in. So. I'm gonna work all this out and see what I can do. Okay, I found these little like twist tie silvery things. I wish they were gold, it's okay. <laughs> um, but they're like twist ties and they work perfectly for the little gift tags. And that way I can like structure them. I just kind of like twisted it and then tucked it. And then at least they're like kind of all matching. So yeah, love that. The cats are just screaming outside. <laughs> all of the bags are back, so cute. I love the tags. I'm really glad that I was able to find something to tie them with so it's like a little bit more structured. And I've put the candles in here in the holder just cause I am gonna be traveling and driving. So I wanna make sure that they stay safe. And now to figure out how to pack the mugs up. All right, I have everything locked and loaded here. So we have a layer of bubble wrap, then we have the candles, then we have the mugs, then we have all of the bags fit perfectly and then the spare mugs that didn't fit quite underneath to make everything even. Gonna put some bubble wrap on top and then just tape up the box and then I'll just bring this in and set it all up. Cute, still don't really know how I'm gonna do that, but I will film their reaction, so. This part is at least checked off my list. It's almost six o'clock now and we are gonna order dinner to pick up on my way to the studio because I have class tonight and a meeting before. And I think this is where I'm going to leave you guys for today and I will see you tomorrow. Good morning. It is Thursday. My lips are so chapped. I need to put on chapstick. I'm about to head into the chiropractor. That's the first order of business today. And then I think I'm likely driving all the way out to Coquitlam again. I will tell you guys more about that in a bit but yeah first this and then I have an eye doctor appointment at 3 15 and then I have to pick something up at 5 and then I have an event at 5 30. It's gonna be a very busy day. My brain is ready to explode. There's a lot to do. It's all fun but it's like it's a lot. There's a lot to do today but I'm excited to go get my back cracked. <laughs> a bit of a mess because it is absolutely downpouring outside but I've secured the goods. As you guys can see I'm here at Smash and Tess. This is like their warehouse and I have secured rompers for the trip. As you guys know, I went to a Smash and Test event last week and I've been in touch with them about getting rompers for the trip and for all of my friends and of course myself too. And I'm so excited. I don't own any Smash and Test rompers other than the collab they did with Benefit a while back. And so I'm really excited for everyone to be super comfy all weekend and to surprise them with this because this is like the last little thing. I didn't know if it was actually gonna happen or not because um, I've been like planning it for a while, but it just timing was like kind of crazy so I can't believe I've been able to secure so many fun things for everyone I'm so excited this is like my favorite thing ever I love gift giving and I'm honestly just so grateful and thankful for these brands that want to work with me in this capacity like I think that's one of the coolest parts about being on social media and having the job I do is being able to share these like things with my friends and the people I care about so yeah I'm just I'm really excited I I think I'm gonna keep everything in the box. I'm not really sure. I definitely wanna like try mine on and show you guys what it looks like. I'm so excited, they're so cute. We got the Friday rompers in black, I'm pretty sure. So hopefully that's what's in there. Okay, I have the romper on and it's amazing. For size reference, I'm wearing a medium and this is the Friday romper in midnight black, I think is the color. It's just black and it's so cute. It has pockets, full length sleeve and full pants. It is so comfy. I know I'm gonna get so much use out of this, just like lounging around at home, but also I was thinking this would be great at dance shows in between numbers when you're like trying to stay warm and you need something big enough to go over the top of your costume, but like still be like mobile in. So perfect, I love it, it's so cute. 
And I also can't wait to wear this all weekend because I'm gonna be so cozy. It is well into the evening now. I haven't updated you, I think, since I tried on the Smash and Test romper, um, but I've done a lot since then. I went to the eye doctor. I've been having this redness. If you guys watch the vlogs, you know. So I went to the eye doctor and I got dilated and my eyes are still quite, quite big. <laughs> and then after that, I came home quickly got ready and then Cody and I went to the mall to pick something up and then we went to the Vancouver Christmas market. It was pouring rain so it was um, a very short little festive adventure. We basically just went for the food. We had pierogies, we had goulash, I think that's how you say it. It's like stew in a bread bowl. It was so good and then capped it off with a chimney cake which is my favorite and then we left and I came home. And I finished packing, I've showered, blow dried my hair and I put on self tanner so everything is pretty much good to go. I am pretty well packed. I just kind of packed like comfy clothes. I wasn't super sure kind of what to do or what to bring, but I have everything in here. It's like a couple white fox sets. I have all the rompers in here as well. I also have like my tripod, toiletries. Um, like I said, a white fox set. I have the gray and then I also have the brown I'm bringing. One pair of jeans, that uh, Reformation sweater down there. And then I have another sweater from H&M, a couple tank tops, a couple bras, lots of socks. And then I think tomorrow on the boat, I will just wear this uh, Sherpa. This is also from Revolve, super cute. You guys will be seeing a haul very soon if it's not already up on my channel, but I'm gonna wear that probably just to keep it comfy. I was thinking about bringing my actual snow boots, but I think I'm gonna pass and just wear my combat boots. I'm not really sure what the snow situation is up there. I feel like they don't have that much because snow season or the ski season doesn't open until next weekend, but I could be very wrong on that. But I also don't think I'm gonna be spending that much time outside. So I think this is good. I have cozy things. I know that that's what I'm going to wear and I'm always cold, so I'm going to end up sleeping in sweatpants, I already know it. So that's why I have a lot of that stuff packed. As I'm winding down for the evening, I wanna let you guys know that I'm not putting any pressure to film the trip. I will hopefully get a couple clips of surprising them and hopefully like the cabin and stuff, but I'm not putting any pressure to like fully film a vlog. So I will insert any clips I get going forward after this. <laughs> Good night guys, see you tomorrow. Okay guys, so we're at the cabin now. I'm about to set everything up. I have sent them all downstairs to just chill while I set everything up. I'm so excited. It's so beautiful. Look at this place. Insane. everything set up. I think this is cute. I think this is the best way to do it. Yeah. I don't know. Looks really cute. I'm so excited. Yeah.